hey guys welcome back to the channel today so today i'm going to show you how to install custom songs to pistol whip on your oculus quest okay so just going into the programs you're going to need today you will need w wise side quest and apk easy tool now all the links for these will be down in the description as well so you'll need these before going into uh input those games on your quest so first of all what we're going to need is an audio file that's compatible with pistol whip okay so what we're going to need is to use w wise okay we're going to open that up obviously if you have done this step before maybe on the pc or you do already have a .wem file to hand you can skip this part okay but for those who haven't stick around here so we're going to go into w wise we're going to click double wise then we're going to click launch w wise so in order to make the file we need we're going to need to click new new as in a new project we can name it something normal like um let's just say test oh that one already exists test 12 just random Okay, so this WWISE will only recognize .wav files, okay? So make sure you get a .wav file and you go to up the top, project, import audio file. Find the file and where it is. For me, it's on my desktop. Audio files, I'm just going to bring in the John Wick theme tune. I say theme tune, from the nightclub scene in John Wick. We're going to click import. Okay, give that a second we just need to close this down see this schematic view here all we need to do is click on this if this doesn't show up right away all you need to do is to click on layout schematic or you can press f9 on your keyboard but like i said you click master audio plus there on the title of your song right click and click edit and default conversion setting click edit there scroll across here and where it says format pcm you want to click volbes okay once that's done click convert just waiting for that to convert now it can take a little uh, a little while there we go so that's done we no longer need this program we can close that down Okay, so I've already got my .wem files by here, okay, um, but your WEM files are actually in your documents, and then they are in WWISE projects, there's my test, cache, windows, under SFX, we've got John Wick, and that's our WEM file, so that's completely compatible with Pistol Whip, okay, so I'm just going to drag that out on my desktop, just so I know where it is. Close down WYs. Next of all, what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to go into side quest. Wait for that to load up. Just check that your quest is actually connected up. Know that. So we can see connected. What we're going to do now is click File Explorer. Sorry, not my apps. Notice our pistol whip game is there. We can move across, click the little cog at the end. So what we're going to have to click is backup APK file. Wait for that there. Once again, this can take a few seconds to complete. Also keep an eye on the running task there. There we go, all tasks complete. So what we're going to do now, now we've backed up the APK, we're going to go in, we're going to click open backups. That's going to open up a new folder and we've got APKs there. Then we're going to go back and we're going to uninstall Pistol Whip. 
okay when that's uninstalled you'll see that there quickly go back and refresh that there we go it's no longer on our quest so now we go to the next step now we have removed that from the oculus quest we go to our backups that we just opened we click apk keep that open then you can click on a p k easy to open that up so now we've got the apk there and apk easy to we're going to drag that across into the file and this is what you're going to see okay at this point we're just going to click decompile now just a quick note about this guys make sure you have uh java installed it is up to date if you're using a time 64 bit system then make sure you download the time 64 version of java as well or this step may not work also take this opportunity as well to copy the settings i've got on the right hand side so you want to have these ticked otherwise you won't get the correct outcome okay let's click decompile decompile successful all we need to do now is to click on the decompiled apk directory and that will bring up this so this is actually a list of all the assets and the actual uh, game files and the game folders we're going to go to assets audio generated sound banks android and then we're going to see a list of all the songs there now if you are familiar with this uh, you can just go and change the song that you want for anybody new here click on the global dot text scroll to the bottom now if you see these numbers here these numbers represent a song so for example you can see up by this one by here you can see the grave 18896503 that would mean that if we go back here that's what number this song is so if we look here one eight eight nine six five zero three zero okay so first of all we're going to go back to the WEM file that we created earlier i'm going to minimize this for now we're going to copy one of these i'm just going to use this one as a example Control c we're going to take our file our WEM file which is by here we're going to rename that the same name that matches the file in our decompiled apk and quite simply we're just going to drag it across the destination already has a file named that replace the file in this destination there we go so now i've replaced the song now you could go and theoretically replace every single song that you wanted to just for the sake of this tutorial i'm just going to do the one song so now we've put that back in our assets folder okay we're going to go back to apk easy tool once again just double check these settings because if one's off it will not work and we're simply just going to press compile now what that's going to do real quick is just it's going to put everything back together exactly as it was there we are guys so it's just got sign successful that basically means we've put everything back to as it was initially all we need to do now is click compiled apk directory and you'll see these two okay so a dot apk and a zipper line dot apk all you're gonna have to do now is go into side quest obviously make sure you've deleted the old game file before doing this okay take the zip aligned version not the other one the zip aligned.apk drag that into install let's check the task so guys when that shows up as successful that does mean you have successfully placed custom songs in the oculus quest version of pistol whip now i want to give a big shout out to the guys on the pistol whip mod in discord um, especially pink who helped me with this 
and Elliot Tate who came to me with the idea initially. Big shout out to you guys who have been great as well. Now let's test if this has worked. Let's do this. As you can see guys, I have successfully brought my own custom songs into Pistol Whip. Now if you have liked this tutorial, if you have liked what you've seen, check out some of my other videos. In the meantime, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, I would appreciate it. I'm VR Lad and I'll see you soon. Peace.